<laughs> good day, good day. Welcome to Roverland. How the hunk are you? Welcome, welcome. Yes. Hey, we got another video for you today. Thank you for joining me. This is Roverland. Uh, your friend Dano, Roverland, the channel that's anything and everything. Land Rover. And today we uh, have this little bugger. Yeah, we're just going to jump right into it. Um, I hunt for Land Rovers all over the place. eBay, uh, Marketplace, that's a Facebook thing. Um, and then also, you know, on foot, in the wild, yes. And uh, I got um, I got this one the other day. I opened it up because uh, I didn't know what it was. <laughs> it, it didn't have a tracking number that went with uh, any of my eBay purchases, and I had forgotten that I bought this. But anyway... Um, where is, where was this from? Oh man, I can't remember. Um, I don't believe it was in Wisconsin. Oh, I, I, I lost the, I lost it. I don't remember now. But anyway, uh, it cost me $5 and it, uh, cost me like $5 to send it. So, uh, yeah. Old Timers Antique Center. Yeah, I'm not really sure where that is. Anyway, um, yeah, very nice lady on uh, Facebook Marketplace um, had it listed, and I bought it, and she sent it out. So it was great. So here, what are we taking a look at? But bam Yes, if you hadn't figured it out already, <laughs> this is the Corgi Land Rover 109 wheelbase. And this one in particular is the gift set number 31. Yes, Safari Land Rover and Animal Trailer is what it's called. And uh, normally it would uh, it, it has uh, this here Land Rover and then it has a trailer. If you see right here, it has a trailer. It's uh, got a cage on the top of the two-wheel trailer. So if you know, same white color with the zebra stripes. Uh, so, you know, that comes with it too. Also, there's a little dude that comes out the uh, top there that can stand in there. And um, he's in khaki, of course. And then there's a lion. If you look right here, there's a lion there. A very nice lion. Yes. Anyway, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I, I work too much and that's my problem. Anyway, so <laughs> this is all I've got uh, for five bucks and uh, really, really kind of cool. I'm, I'm really happy to, to get it. I, matter of fact, you know what? If you um, are a long time subscriber and hey, if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. But if you watch my um, channel for any length of time, I'm happy to have any Land Rover. I don't care what kind of condition it is. Um, I'm just happy to have it. So anyway, this is one that I hadn't had. And uh, the other thing I need to mention is um, on here, and I'll kind of, uh, <laughs> for real now, this is not on there. Uh, there's a sticker and it goes all the way down here and it loops around and kind of, uh, dog legs here under here and then comes back around and it would say game park and then there was like a uh, head uh, black and white image of um, what are they called uh, antelope or, or uh, uh, kind of a deer uh, here you know uh, would have its uh, face with eyeballs and then uh, the horns very pokey horns by the way but that was red that went along here. So that's the only thing that's really uh, missing on this vehicle. And then it would be backwards. They, they used the same sticker on this side as, as they did this side. This side uh, reads correctly, game park. Uh, and then it is backwards kind of game park this way. And then the uh, head would be up this way. So uh, very interesting there. And so, yeah, so uh, it came in, uh, it, it was a gift pack or gift set, number 31, and it was in a bigger box, you know, it was in a box with uh, 
shadow uh, shadow box with a window uh, top and side so you could see the whole uh, thing and it was in a tray that uh, this was mounted on or in uh, and sold that way. Now as we see this is uh, pretty much just a uh, enamel white with uh, black tires and silver hubs. Now there was a variation and I believe it's on sale on eBay in the UK right now um, with red hubs. Yeah, so yeah, like the, the red interior, it had uh, matching red hubs. So really kind of cool. I didn't. I don't really know um, too much about uh, why the red hubs. If that was an early model, and then this is the later model or not. But anyway, at white enamel with the um, the uh, zebra stripes on it. And now these, all these stripes are uh, original here. And then right in here, they did some modifications because I think the sticker kind of when it got pulled off or came off. Uh, these are kind of modifications here uh, to the zebra stripes, but these are all genuine real here. So very, very kind of interesting. Uh, as you see, it has a red interior. And as you see, it is a right hooker. Very, very nice. Um, this is a metal die cast door. And uh, usually this door on these uh, models is missing. So it's nice to have the door at least. Uh, all the windows are closed, uh, even the nice back uh, windows here, but they're all closed. Very nice front end there. We did take a look at that. So it's a Series 3 with the plastic grill, bonnet hood on it with a tire on the hood. Uh, and as you saw, it has a hole in the roof and very unique to this model. This is the only model that had this particular manhole and then this this uh, kind of um, uh, emulates or whatever the, the, the opened lid would flip back there. You kind of see how it's kind of raised up a little bit. So it kind of emulates that they flipped open the uh, lid. But uh, very nice. No other uh, painted details other than the zebra stripes on the side. So very kind of cool. And then the trailer, which was a two two wheel trailer, uh, kind of almost you know kind of looked like that. <laughs> and uh, and like I said, it had a cage on the on the top. But you can go ahead and Google that uh, Corgi gift set number thirty one, and you can find all kinds of images about this. Uh, vehicle and uh, you you know what you probably have one yourself <laughs> yeah corgis are really hard to get a hold of here in the states so uh, really kind of cool and for five bucks in this kind of condition I really came out good well it was actually ten bucks but awesome awesome so talking about this we're gonna talk about the rest of the vehicles that I have in my collection which are similar to this um, model, and that would be this one here, same basic base, and this is the Forest Fire Warden, uh, very, very much alike of the same, uh, except for tan interior, uh, and no hole in the roof, and the roof rack, and this has, uh, this is always, and I've never really spent the money to get one with the ladder that comes down the side. This actually is the junkiest one that I have. Uh, this is the next one here. Uh, same kind of thing, uh, missing the uh, back door. But this is number, um, number 421. And uh, so now here's one of the, some of the nicer ones that I have of this style of, uh, uh, now this one's interesting, it doesn't have the Corgi up on the uh, top um, like the rest of them did. I didn't, I never, well that one doesn't either. Wow, what the heck is going on? This one does, that one did. So this must be a, a different era of something. Uh, I've got one more here, and uh, see now this one has, and this is the best of the best that I have. Well those are kind of odd. You guys know why that is? Really kind of odd. Anyway, so um, well, this one had the back door 
and um, this one has a back door. Like I say, this is one of my nicer ones that I have. Um, even the interior on this one is a lot darker. Which one was it? It was really dark. Maybe not. Maybe just dark because it looks... Uh, now, and anyway, sorry about that. I get sidetracked. I get sidetracked on these variations. But anyway, so this is uh, what I have for the Forest Fire Warden. And um, very nice. Chrome, chrome wheels. I'm not really sure. I, it, I don't think this one came with trailer, did it? Maybe it did. But anyway, um, so that was, uh, so, you know, this is going to be a really nice addition to this one with no holes in the uh, roof. And then I do have one more. That uh, is the Corgitronics Police Land Rover. And here you can see the Corgitronics uh, uh, trademark there. A uh, little bit different. Now this one is very, very much uh, heavier and uh, solid roof. But then they, they changed up the roof on this. And as you can see, quite a bit. So it, it's like a whole nother casting. And they put this... Uh, bubblegum machine <laughs> cheese balls bubblegum yeah bubblegum machine up front put this uh envelope um office envelope sticker on the side that says police chrome wheels as well darken the windows because uh this is the uh, electronic one and uh, the interior seems to be kind of the same and then you can i don't think i can pull that out with my fat fingers but anyway um you can uh put on a uh, uh a battery and it's supposed to make noise, and I, I'm not, I can't get that out. But anyway, uh, very, very nice one. This was one of my first ones that I had uh, purchased. Uh, I think I bought this one off eBay. I got, I made a, a video of uh, these uh, a while ago, and so we uh, revisited because it got a new one to the collection. So this is awesome. So uh, yeah, very, very nice. I don't know what happened there. I don't know if the electronics inside melted or somebody uh, had a cigarette that was going. I don't. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, there we go. That's kind of an update on the uh, Corgi Land Rover 109 uh, wheelbases that uh, are in the Roverland collection. Very happy to have these. This is really kind of cool. I do have a special uh, little display case that I keep these in. Uh, matter of fact, the uh, fire, the forest fire warden is kind of taking over the display case. And I got some Smokey the Bear stuff in there, a uh, uh, fan favorite when I was a little kid. But anyway, all right, well, there you go. Thanks for joining me today, taking a look at the gift set number 31 from Corgi, the Safari Land Rover and Animal Trailer. Oh, which came out, I forgot to mention, which came out in 1976 to 1979. So very kind of cool. All right, I'm out of here. Thank you for joining me today. Make sure that you guys, uh, you know, keep safe and uh, keep out of trouble. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And as always, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.